Hey, what's up you guys? It is Daisy Styles here and today I have a super exciting video for you guys. I feel like I say that in every unboxing video, but oh my gosh, I've been waiting for this for around two weeks and it finally arrived. It is a package with some supplies and some other surprises from this company, Ma Model Forever Sand. I don't know how to pronounce it. I ordered some stuff from there that I've never ordered before and I'm super duper excited to unbox it. So I guess we should just get on to it. Okay, so first I see this like the... Oh, it is... Oh my gosh! Okay. So I, I've been really into making western tag lately, so I bought these western bits. They're like the rose pattern. They look so good. And then I bought these, this like full cheek bit piece, I think it's called. And then these western buckles. Now let's get into the main event. I am so pleased to say that there's so much bubble- oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, look! <laughs> I bought epoxy sculpt. I've been wanting epoxy sculpt for so long. And I finally got it. I've been using this paper clay, and if you watched my latest video, you'll know what a pain that was to use. So, epoxy is like really strong, so I'm super excited to use this for my um, customs. So, yes. Alright, there's one more thing. I think it's right here. Okay, I've never had one of these before and I'm so excited. Okay, it is a collector. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, she's really big. Oh, but she's gorgeous. This is my first ever collector. I just love the detail in the sculpting. Wow. Here she is side by side with a Belleville and a Schleich horse. So she is the 2004 Chestnut Missouri Fox Trotter. I actually thought she was a bay, but she pretty obviously looks like a chestnut. Now, she is obviously a little bit bigger scale than Schleich horses, which I find kind of weird because I think they're I think they're 118 scale both, but I still love her and I will use her a lot. I think Collecta sculpting is absolutely gorgeous and I've I think I'm going to be leaning over to Collecta more than Schleich. Now that Schleich 2019 has come out, and if Schleich doesn't improve their stuff, then I am going to definitely lean more over to Collecta because their sculpting is pretty gorgeous, and even though I'm not the biggest fan of their coloring, to be honest, um, they're very great repaint potentials, and yeah, I'm not sure if I'm going to repaint this girl or not. I think I might but I might just keep her like this for a while. Let's see if Schleich Tag will fit her. So uh, Schleich Tag does fit her very nicely. Um, the only thing I noticed is that her belly kind of has weird proportions. Okay, she kind of looks pregnant. Um, as you can see, she's very wide here. Um, but I don't know, maybe she's pregnant. She probably shouldn't be ridden then. But um, yeah, they kind of had this like triangle kind of thing going on. She looks so adorable, and I'm kind of losing my mind. And she looks great with Schleich riders too, I don't think she's too big for them. She's kind of bigger than most Schleich horses, but she still kind of fits everything like tack and stuff and riders that Schleich horses usually would, so it's kind of weird. <laughs> it might be because her legs are really long, I don't know. But yeah, that wraps up this unboxing. So thank you guys so so much for watching this video, I really hope you enjoyed it, I certainly enjoyed making this video, and comment down below if you have any suggestions for this lovely girl, and any color suggestions if 
I'm going to repaint her. I would love some color suggestions. And yeah, so you can look forward to some customs with epoxy sculpt and maybe a repaint video. Thanks again for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!